I love this angle. Take me down. You bought it up and you like to stay. Enjoy this game radio with me. <laughs> The pursuit online. Here they are. Oh, Emma Chia. These might be the ones. These. Thank you guys so much. How nice. Oh, the gradient. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kissed. By the way, just got in Welcome to a new vlog. Okay, let me be serious. Welcome to a new vlog week. Construction in Zima in Zala, a crane that is so long. I've never seen a crane that high. Anyways, good morning guys. Welcome to a new video. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe to my family. Uh, like, I, I, I come from such a high. I think I need to do all my intros straight after like reading my YouTube comments because... Hey guys, you understand? Like, my heart is on to crack. <laughs> anyways, I'm always in such a good mood when I read comments like uh, <laughs> Good morning you guys. Hey, we're the second time Not good at all, but okay, we push we move on so it's a new week ish Not much is going on work side of life, but this week I am viewing some apartments because remember, Angelina Lewis, I'm moving. So, um, I was supposed to be viewing today, but actually, getting bigger than my apartment, I was just being a bit too ambitious. They were too overpriced. And so, I was like, hey, as in, I was in why you I'm viewing, I need to come back to reality and look for apartments that are more in my price range. Because I'm just like, hey, it's over you know, when you tell yourself that. But actually, I don't want to strain myself and get rente. I've never done that. I like that my rent is so affordable that it's not something that I'm like, Ish, my rent, my rent, rent, rent. So as much as I want to get something obviously closer to CBD, which means it'll cost slightly more, I want it to be slightly more. I was looking at something a bit more dramatic, drastically more, you know, because I was just like, YOLO, J Bengi, Kotlisa, Ipsu, last week. Anyway, so yeah i had to reassess re you know and set new viewings and like if some of my viewings are straight like in a week they have one day everyone was view on that one day and day about Lali. so yeah i have viewings um what else is going on nothing i guess this is a one and how the week goes i can't watch the car because we get later all the time um ish. I don't know what's gonna happen. I think this week it's either I'm gonna go to Port Elizabeth, you wanna throw at me, or he's gonna come this time. I don't know. I'm just, it's, I'm just offing to go and I don't know why. Like, I'm just like, ugh, like, I don't know. I don't know. But he's been asking me to come that side and I always make an excuse because I just feel like this side, there's so much more things to do. I know everything here. But that side, he's like super introverted, he doesn't go out. So it's like, I feel like even they, I'm still going to have to like, okay, what are we going to do? Like, let me look for what we're going to do while I'm here. And DJ, I give you a little bit one thing about me. But maybe I'll go for the sake of this vlog, ne? Maybe I'll go for the sake of the vlog. So I'll see. I'll see. I'll decide by like, maybe tomorrow. Yo, so Wednesday, Jalok Sars, damn. The week is going too fast. But yeah, anyways, let's start this vlog and let's see how this week goes. I love you guys so much and I appreciate you guys. I, I, excuse. <laughs> I appreciate you guys so much. I am feeling so warm right now. Jane, get tired, get tired, get tired. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Something was telling me with Angji Gelaba, Ganga Ji, Ganga Tunisi Kanda, and there is a literal strike. La Nanjinga Manch, Wama, Sai Soli, Sai Soli. I wish there was a U turn that I could do, but you know, anxiety, Angsan, what am I saying? You know, my anxieties, shame was me, Julie. Bang, what's it like? On break duty, I'm sitting outside. I am freezing. Kuya Banda. Yo, hi Banda. <laughs> My sister's drama. me, should deserve me. I want to buy it handy in Dub. As soon as I come to hang out the camera, so we're gonna look inside. Yeah, Nina in Dubazako. I just came from the police station. Remember my phone here last year? I want to use the Wi Fi card. Wi Fi is going to protect. Hey, I'm so happy in Jacobs. I'm done with Ubers. Like, I am a Uber and Kapazega cool dude. A cool dude. Hindi. But yeah, at least I have a phone to fall back on if any of my phones die or anything like that. Because we sing an iPhone. Hey, what's why sees Abu? Yes, what's why sees. Anyways, let me go home and make food. It's like two o'clock. I haven't eaten today. I'm like starving. Yo, and give me some karma, and I hope they're gonna be really quick. So, the place where I bought my tribe the other day, I'm here. I, I never expected it to be like diesel, but I'm trying to get a hearty meal because it's cold and it's raining. But it's a house. Well, it looks like a house outside. Gang, gang, in the camera, I am so yiki. So, I'm just gonna go in and try and buy food and come back out quickly. I hope it's gonna be quick, seamless. Mm, hey, Kiriba. My skin shame is going through it. I'm going to find fresh. My skin shame has not been right for the past two months. I'm fun. Yes, what's up, fun? Because of the fact that I'm going to find a fresh. 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 Anyways, let me get food. I'm in the hold you tight to me when you're lost and you're alone. Yo, I've spoken so much and the video wasn't even taking. Wow. Anyways, um, yeah, so it's literally raining so hard. I'm so grateful that like I was able to buy this stuff before the rain started because now it's raining hard, hard, hard. And when I got out the shop, I got like, you know? If it's one thing I'm grateful for, it's the fact that God gave me this car. Like, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know how I got through the winters in the past, but actually scary like it's, it's like i'm so grateful anyways um i got scraped and yogurt because i really want to get back into eating breakfast it's so bad that i eat like one meal a day because mine is the whole tool i'm going to eat i'm going to feel so full and i won't eat until tomorrow 
but yeah i bought some tribe i went to the same place yes it's over eats guys uber each charges 100 rand for this man figures tall yes malin 55 rand i was like yo uber eats check eh? and cabbage and chakalaka i'll have this tomorrow so i'll have this with like grilled chicken i'll just grilled chicken lightly and maybe make some rice or something so i'm just making sure i have food for tomorrow then i'll think pagula but yeah hey 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 I love this angle. I was just trying to take this video. And it's actually so cute. Hey guys, I'm feeling a bit tired today. I don't know why. But I just got home. I went to run some errands. So um, I find that a lot of apartment blocks that I have wanted to stay in, I'm just not seeing them like online so i was like okay i'm gonna drive around and sort of well one i wanted to take a drive because i feel like my head is about to burst i am very anxious about like moving so i'm like i think the anxiety is just building up and building up and building up okay so yeah um, i wanted to take a drive and then when i was taking a drive i was like okay let me just actually also I can like go into the building and ask them what's, do they have any apartments available so I did that with a couple of buildings and I got some numbers oh <laughs> out I got some numbers um but the first place okay so I went the first place got did these agent downstairs and then he showed me an apartment I wasn't vlogging because I actually was not planning on viewing anything I was just more so wanting to go around and speak to people because the places that i had the places that i had set up for viewing all of a sudden six here and then i have to pre-apply get pre-approved for the place before i can yeah basically and i don't want to do that because if they punch in my id wherever whatever it's it's going to affect another application if i decide not to go through with those apartments you know so um it was basically one block and it was a couple of options inside this block so um yeah yeah so it's back to the drawing board right now um i just got home i'm gonna try and search for apartments actually let me take off my bra I'm so tired and yeah that's it just a little bit stressed just a little bit But yeah, mm. let's take five. <laughs> oh, yes. Quarter plus ten. Yeah, it's late. We'll talk. Have some, have some rest. Have some rest. I'll just text you if, uh, just to check up on you if you still up. But I just think you're going to sleep. I hope you sleep. Yeah, same. I hope so as well. Yeah. No, no problem. We'll talk in the morning, then. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay, okay. We'll talk in the morning, then. Okay, bye bye. Love you so much. Bye. Bye. Yes. If that nigga not obsessed with me, I don't want him. He is not my type. Young. Oh, that is a little. Oh gosh, I last wore this in nice now. Nah. And the bows, come nine, they go Sam that day. 
gone are those days it's winter now anyways um i'm gonna try and wind down and go to bed because oh try and wind down and go to bed because i have to go to work tomorrow morning yeah there's not much that's been happening to be honest i know but today i was just in the house and i created this tiktok video which i haven't done in a very long time i think the last time i tiktoked i don't remember but anyways yeah it was nice and i did say that i want to get back into my content bag so i'm jay yes if you guys see any of my reels my tiktoks anything please make sure to interact with that content because i really really want to broaden my horizons in terms of um influencing i want to get back out there and start doing those things again because work season is quiet now anyways yeah so i'm gonna try and go to bed um early so i can wake up early and be bright and bushy tailed and yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs> to work um, at Woody's so yeah let's have a good day shan't we I can't believe I got a jacket I'm gonna be so cold do you know why it's because while I'm filming YouTube content I'm simultaneously trying to film um, a real um, 
so that's why. But anyway, I have to get myself used to it because usually, like, if I'm gonna shoot a reel, I won't vlog that day. Can you imagine? So mm. it's so cold. My lips are even like blue. So yeah, I want to get myself used to the fact that I have to vlog all, at all times and be able to be, oh, be able to multitask. So, anyways, let's go. Six months ago, yeah. Good, man. I've been here for six months. Good, man. Yeah. I've been coming back. It's all right. I come in like once a month, maybe. Ooh, it's nice. <laughs> all right. Um, so the other guy got cancelled at the last minute because suddenly we got a message from a beautiful light over here. There we go. He needs nothing, this guy. It's like, you know, I look at him and watch go even super perfect skin. So we do very, very little. Um, My name's Kelly. She works at the, um, do you know the e-com house or the, the media house that's in Normanton? Which one do you want to start with? Yeah. Yeah. Do you end up in this? Do you feel like it's too short? Every, I mean, it's a little bit short, but you can also like find a way. Because I, you must also guide us with what you hear. What do you mean, what do you mean after? Do you like what you hear? What do you mean, what do you mean after? Do you like to stay? Like, obviously, that's obviously that's not that long, you know. But like, no. But I think they must start with the down. Oh, okay. Um, that might not work. Um, it's thicker. Yeah, that's short. So it's here loose. So we can do one with the one. Okay. That's cool. We always have your hair one way. The way he showed it presented side is how we always have it. I want us to do something cool. That's the best thing. Was VM? I'm not quite sure if it's audio visual or if it's actually a stills picture. But it's it's not this what we do this morning is get ready with me as I get ready to go to my friend's husband party so I'm gonna do my makeup and do a little OOTD but I'm not gonna speak because I'm trying to shoot a TikTok at the same time so if I talk I'm gonna get distracted and I'm not gonna remember what's what and which video goes with what so enjoy this get ready with me
Okay, guys, I decided to do a voiceover to add to these videos because Gina drama and Jane from Kulum. So I first concealed my eyebrows with a bit of a neutral tone concealer just to like get it nice and neatened out. And then I like to use a bit of a lighter concealer to highlight the arch or arc, whichever one you use, of my eyebrow like I'm doing here. It just brings like more of a brighter conceal to your eyebrow. If you're into that sort of thing, you can do that. But if you're not, you can skip the step. But for me, when I put eyeshadow, it sort of brings out the brightness of my conceal and it makes it even look really nice when I've concealed it a bit brighter. And then I blend that all in together and it sort of makes the two tones marry into each other and it looks beautiful. And then for a bit of a better or a thicker consistency in terms of foundation i really like this maybelline superstay foundation if i'm going for something a bit um i would say less coverage sometimes i don't like to have like full full coverage on my face and i want to look like i sort of did like very simple makeup then i'll either use if it me um the thing is with fit me you have to make sure that you've prepped your skin really well but the alternative is fit me foundation yaga maybelline as well or I would use Lancome, which is a bit more creamy, but a lot less um, foundation. And then I use the same concealers again, the Rimmel and the Benefit on top, just to add a highlight. Yeah, but when I put the Rimmel on its own, it's still really good. It's still really blended out and highlighted. But because I know the way that I like my makeup, I like to add more of like a highlight to just highlight my eyes and it makes sense when i bake because if i'm baking i like to bake with a lighter powder so if i bake with a lighter powder on sort of a medium tone concealer the contrast is too dramatic and so the two tones sort of fight with each other but when i've highlighted under my eye with something a bit more brighter it sort of helps um blend everything in more nicely sorry about my runny nose it's very cold so i keep having to wipe it and it's very frustrating anyways yeah then i bake my face with the huda um, baking powder uh, that's the best that i've found so far it really makes sure there's like no caking and weird like sort of color all around my face and then sorry it's, it's, it, it makes sure the, the bake is nice and clear and not like sort of cakey and breaking and then i just use a compact powder a v beauty palette compact powder to bring the neutralization into my face so i would be using the compact powder that is my skin tone from that palette and can you see that it sort of brought um the tones a bit darker into my skin and then i used my blush also v beauty palette i don't like a lot of blush so i usually just use a little bit of red and mix it a bit with pink and it gives me like a really nice neutral bronzy tone on my blush because i really don't like blush that much yeah this install i rushed it to be honest with you guys i didn't install my hair properly um and i was just getting ready to go i was already late so yeah my install was not perfect but it actually came out pretty good and then i used the v beauty nude palette to do my eyes um this palette has a lot of nude colors you guys should check it out on v beauty on instagram their products are really good um, i bought their foundations a while ago as well so um those are really nice this tutorial <laughs> was inspired by somebody asking me to do a tutorial on my page i know that i explained last time that i wouldn't be doing um tutorials anymore on my on my vlogs but i actually think well god answered my prayers and i found a way to incorporate them in a way that is not like me sitting down and making a tutorial video because i feel like those videos don't get much views but i never actually thought of incorporating them into my weekly vlogs anyways that way it works nicely and smoothly i really like that this idea came about and so i was able to do this anyways um you guys had asked me about the Selmayak, Selmaki, Sel oh, sorry, I don't know how to pronounce the name of those foundations. They, I found that they had a bit of a red undertone that I didn't like. But when I mix them with some of my other um, makeup products in terms of like, if I'll use a, their foundation and then I contour with V Beauty or I contour with Black Opal, it works really well. But the consistency, I would say it's a 
Lancome consistency, sort of in between Lancome and Estee Lauder. Very creamy, full coverage, but not as heavy as I'd say Estee Lauder is. So it's somewhere in the middle there. Um, but it's just that tone, tone-wise, I think, yeah, you would need to correct it a little bit because it is, some of them do give a bit of a red undertone and some of them do give too much of a yellow undertone. So they do need a bit of correcting um, in terms of blush or, I mean, sorry, in terms of contouring or highlighting. Here, I just use the same palette that I used for my powder to do underneath my eyes, to put a bit of eyeshadow underneath my eyes. I think that when I don't put eyeshadow under my eyes, it sort of makes my eyes very small. And Veda, I already have small eyes. So once I've concealed and I leave it like that, sometimes I like that Asian look. But today, I really wanted my eyes to be open. And so that's why I just opted to put some eyeshadow underneath my eye. Um... And then I used this V Beauty Gold Deposit. I really, really love it. It has like this perfect gold shimmer that I use on all my clients. It's like my signature thing. I love it. <laughs> it makes everyone just look so whimsical and cute. Yeah, but I don't know what to call it, but I love it. And I always use it on myself. And so therefore I use it on my clients as well. And yeah, that's about it. Um, the lashes, of course, I bought them from Mimi Q. If you watch my videos, um, you would have seen that I am a avid believer in Mimi Q. And basically, I just lined my lips with my eyebrow pencil, which is a normal brown pencil. And I used the Switch Beauty Gloss, and that's it. <laughs> The OOTD for this outfit is going to be real. I was too distracted. I couldn't do everything at once. But anyways, I'm ready. How cute is this jacket? I got this jacket from Foshini. Um, it's really, really cute. Um, in the inside, so I had to get that fixed. And I'm just wearing a dress from Super. And some sandals. And I'm carrying my Gucci bag. And yeah, so I quickly actually remembered somebody had asked me what to do with like smile lines and creases like this. So I was actually about to fix my own, so I thought I'll add it to this video. So how to fix um your frown lines. Okay. I'm out of breath because I'm like all over the place. Oh, okay. So basically how to fix your frown lines or your smile lines on the side of your mouth is you would take a compact powder, whether it's your circle powders that everyone else uses. This is just what I use because I'm a makeup artist. Obviously, I have to have a lot of colors on one palette. So you would take your powder that you would usually set your face with. And then I'm just going to take a bit of it like this and pump it. And then open up your ear and put it into there. Do the same with my eye. And maybe a little bit under my eye just, for, just to show you guys. Uh, exactly like this and just let it sit a little bit put some setting spray on it I'm not going to because I've used seal it after my setting spray and the seal it I don't like to put another setting spray on top of it so this is usually like pack the powder pack the compact powder into your creases and that will help you um, to not have smile lines so yeah I just wanted to show you guys that because I also wanted to fix that. Um, yeah, I'm not going to set it with setting powder because, you know, oh, I'm not going to set it with setting powder because it's going to, it's going to map because I've already used a, a sealing spray. And yeah, let's go out. Hey, is she some So, I am. Um, off to Cindy's man's birthday. Oh, Cindy's. I work with her at Woolies. Is on a big corner. Another car. Everybody in this parking, and I was so squashed that man, you my car's actually not able to come out. So, um, yeah, I'm going to Cindy's man's the first 20, 40 kilometers of the uprun birthday party, um, and it's in Camps Bay. So hopefully we'll have nice fun there. Um, I'm going with Nande. I met her at Woolies, but um, we've gotten to know each other. We have so many things in common, actually. And she's really, really sweet. She's a really sweet girl. So um, they also are 
friends and Nandi Nande also works at Woolies so we're going together and Ola's gonna meet me there as well guys remember Ola my friend um, she's coming as well um, so yeah hopefully it's just nice and chill and we have a good time um yeah um yeah and so was I don't know, I put drinks pale. Ning lauli, the pale and young laula gives one gun, good similanga, puz lime with it, and got drinking and drive. So couldn't take a little pre drink with me. I am raw dogging it. Yeah, guys, let's go. Let's go pick up Nance and then let's go and have some fun. Hopefully, I can vlog and. There's no weird feelings, but I guess it's like my friend's man's birthday party. I don't understand it's something I've been thinking about. So I think I I think I can vlog in that situation. But yeah, I always just give when I give vibe good mm, am I like invading people's privacy? Some other people just don't mind, like they just get it, they get social media, but other people don't. And because of that, I never want people to feel like I am sort of imposing my social media onto them. So I sort of read the room and that really helps me <laughs> determine whether or not I'm going to vlog. So hopefully today everything is chill and nice and we can vlog and have a good night. And yeah, tomorrow I want to go to church. Definitely. Oh, Jesus. Sorry, Nova. 100%. And fuck, I'm supposed to take this left hand turn. Okay, I'll take it at Wicks. Oh no, there's no left hand turn at Wicks. Anyways, let me go and be serious about my life so that I can focus on what's going on. Okay, since we have a minute, let's just do a little talky talk. I'm so stressed about what to do in terms of like moving, right? Um, I basically, I'm looking at this building where I'm picking um, Nandi up and I know that there's a a two bedroom in this building that I've been seeing and I'm sort of like so torn because I've lived in Woodstock and I know Woodstock and I am um, if it's one thing that has in Osai Woodstock it's the wind it's like you guys know like I was complaining about it I bought all this overpriced outdoor furniture and I was not able to use it because of the wind you know and yeah the the two bedroom is very beautiful and it's like um modern finishes very nice but it's like at the end of the day i don't know if oh here's an ending if i can like be able to stay there with the situation hey girl are you wearing heels Nande? <laughs> i love your faith in the place what is it it's a house I don't have a choice. I don't have anything else. It was oh, either okay. this or the boots. <laughs> you look nice though. You're I so dressed up. Am I? This is a jersey. And I thought to my, you know what I thought to myself? I'm like, oh yeah, I'm going to be jersey. Tarina's here. She's going to be jersey. That's how I felt. I was like, you look hot, but it's like, it's
so I'm getting ready to go into bed. Oh, it's a bit blurry. I don't know why. So I'm getting ready to go into bed, and I know I'm a bit buzzed, but I'm just thinking about how, like, it's so weird how not knowing a language or not being secure in a language makes you feel a bit insecure. Obviously, I'm an overthinker, but I was, like, trying to speak closer because they're closer and I'm Zulu. So, but it's like, when you speak closer, obviously, you won't pronounce things um, accurately, and you won't say things the way that you're supposed to say them. But, like, I, I will try. <laughs> I'm actually really proud of myself for trying and um, I think I know more closer, definitely more closer than I've ever known. I, I used to think I know closer. I used to think I know closer um, from Durban and the way that that our moms and sisters and, and whatever relatives used to speak about what closer is. When I moved here, I realized that I did not know anything about closer people. I did not know anything about the closer language. I do not know anything about how to speak Kosa. So I've improved a lot. I've improved a lot. And I understand a lot of things like the security downstairs. Um, because I don't leave the house a lot. Um, when I come this when I come downstairs, she'll be like, I hope I'm saying right. I hope I'm saying it right. I'm like, ngabili. So in Zulu, that's like, you said no. I'm like, what did I say no to? Like, I've, uh, you didn't ask me anything, you know. Guys, I've literally been in bed all day. I just got a call that I got a delivery. So. Not Ned Flores delivering on a Sunday, okay, so that's, that's some crazy work ethic, but yeah, I'm just gonna go downstairs to fetch that and just go to the shop quickly to buy a, a tornado at the garage because I have mad cravings right now for like something. This is, ah, it's a wimple for something sweet. Let's head out real quick. Gachola, I mean, I think about me. This is Gachola, I've been Gazina, I've been Gachelil. How cute. I've had hectic hair pains all day. It just says get better soon. Obviously, it's for my man. Thank you to my man. What's in here? Oh, it's chocolate. <laughs> Such a cutie. I just felt like shit all day. And I needed a, a pick-me-up. So it's so cute. Because he's actually listening. I hope he's not watching my YouTube. <laughs> I was like recently, not complaining per se, but I was just like, you know, respectfully, you need to pull up your socks. So I think it's so cute when like a man actually listens to you. That was really cute and thoughtful. <sighs> I'm back home. I am getting into bed. <laughs> I am useless lately. I'm feeling gosh, but oh, I'm enjoying it. I am enjoying being useless. But anyway, I'm just thinking about like being with my 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 now guy. You know, it's like it's just so refreshing. You know, you never know what the future holds. Obviously, like I me, mean, I always leave place for space for disappointments when it comes to relationships because people are very flippy floppy in general. But like, it's just so nice that. It's so refreshing to have a guy who's just very bold about their love for you, their interest in you. Like, I never have to, like, wonder if my boyfriend is, like, likes me. It's never, like, hot and cold. It's never anything. And, like, I don't know. I guess that's also what, like, makes me continue to want to be in the relationship because I never feel confused about, you know, where we're at. And with 
growing up now like in in my age group it's so demotivating you know when you meet a guy who's sort of like hot and cold because like nobody has time for that but anyways it was making me just think about this past relationship i had and i was dating i think to this day he's still the worst guy i've ever dated and he ended up cheating with my friend so i was like actually i'll do a story time for that because wow wow <laughs> anyways i'm just gonna chill home now talk later good morning you guys so i've had a busy ass morning i'm on the phone i went to go pick up my deliveries from postnet and then i had to post stuff i was posting makeup to my sister i was posting yes <sighs> okay i got distracted but yeah so today's a monday hey lay vlog at this week it's gonna be short but you know what it's okay because all the vlogs don't have to be long <laughs> so i got a little package um i think though it's shades so there's a girl that inboxed me that she would like to send me some stuff um if i'd be open to that i was like yeah sure why not i would be happy to try them out okay so the pursuit online here they are and she says hi snare congratulations on all the milestones you're achieving we have put together a package for you and hope you like it oh that's so cute can't people let me finish this video <laughs> hola how are you Jayami? i'm good how are you okay so yes um I want to see she had sent me like some reference pictures or oh, I think I went into the profile for the shades oh cute and um, I saw that they were really nice shades so I was like yeah sure please send me some I'd love to see them I'd love to try them out oh Emma Chia. these might be the ones these might be my ones I love aviators like they just make me look cool I don't know they make me look rich <laughs> So, hold on. Love this pair. I think this is my favorite. How cute. OMG. I wish I was going on holiday. Beautiful. Um, I'm probably going to go out tomorrow, so I'll wear them with a nice outfit. Thank you guys so much. How nice. Oh, the gradient. Perfect. The Pursuit Online to You Beach Per. Why am I saying online? Yes. The Pursuit Online. Yes, exactly. Love these. Dun, 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 then the other ones. I don't know why I like those ones more. Let's see how these ones look. These also look really good. Oh my gosh, guys. I need to go on holiday. I need to go on holiday and wear a hot ass bikini and my shades. Anyways, thank you guys so much for sending me these. I really love them and I'm going to add them to my shades collection. Um, they are so cute. Um, yeah, I'm just home. I'm trying to send my invoices. I'm trying to sort out my life. Jake will get all right now. I am struggling to find an apartment still. Um, yeah, anyways, let's try and, and go on with the day. Um, I think this is the end of today's vlog. I mean, this week's vlog. Um, oh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope I just saw a spider. Yeah. Uh, Anyways, I love you guys and I'll see you guys in next week's vlog.